Hello stampers and welcome to Laura's Stamp Pad. It is Christmas time and I feel like Christmas is today because my new catalog pre-order just came in and I am so excited. So this is the Occasions Mini Catalog as well as the Celebration Promotion and I am going to do the unboxing and reveal on camera with you now. So I'm so excited. I can't wait to open this box of goodies and look at it myself as well as share it with all of you. And then I'm super excited to start playing with it. So um, be sure to subscribe so that you don't miss out on any future videos that I post. And let me know if there's any um, detailed ones that you would like to see um, in the comments below. So I'm always open for um, hearing any sort of um, recommendations or anything like that. So um, I will do my best to make that happen. So let's get started on this fabulous box of goodies. Um, it's going to be kind of like a mishmash because as I pull things out, I will show them to you. So the stamp sets and the framelits um, might not go together, but there are lots of bundles um, with a stamp set and a coordinating framelit. So first we have the Cake Soiree stamp set. So that's this one here. And you can see I love this one because I love these this cake. But look at this detailed cake and then this detailed present. Super, super excited about that. There is a matching um, framelit set for that. Um, I am not sure where it is. Let's see. I think it's the Sweet Cake Framelits. So that's these here. Look at that. I guess like that. And what I'm super excited about is this image to make a... Um, a cake stand. I think I kind of have an obsession with cake stands. Um, I just, every time I see one, I'm like, ooh, I want that one. It's just so pretty. We can like put something on top of it. Of course, I really don't know where I'm going to put it or why I need to put something on top of it, but um, it's exciting. Um, let's see, what else do we have? We have some ribbons here. This I am super excited about. This is the um, Whisper White Organza Ribbon. So I was sad whenever the Organza Ribbon went away last time, um, but it came back and it's thinner. So it's a lot easier to use. Here is the Whisper White. So it's sort of like a solid on the top and bottom and then like a mesh sheer in the middle. So that's gonna be super fun. The other thing is, is you can color with this. So use your um, blends markers or a spritzer or re-inker, um, anything like that, you can color it. So then you can get any color. So that's super, super fun. I bought two rolls of that because I know I'm going to use a lot of it. Some more ribbon that we got. I have, this is Lemon Lime Twist, and it's like a stripe. I don't know how well you can see that stripe. Do I need to open this one up too? So look how gorgeous that is. Perfect for um, spring. I think that'll be perfect. I just, I love the bright color of that, um, that Lemon Lime Twist. Let's open this one up too. This one is Berry Burst, and this has that metallic edge. I have, I've loved the, um, the white with the silver metallic edge. That's really staticky. And so I was super excited to see this pink with the metallic edge because you guys all know how much I love pink and everything too. So super, super cute. Let's see what else we have. Embossing paste. Okay, so I love embossing paste and now it comes in silver. I am so, so, so excited about this. I can't wait to use it. Um, it is, I think it's just going to be super fabulous. I think it'll go great for a little bit of bling on a project, but I think it'll also be good for um, like man projects where you can add like almost like a silver, like almost like a, a diamond plate look or something like that. So I think that is going to be super, super fun. I did get some masks that go with the, um, the cake soiree. I don't know where they are, um, but they're in here somewhere. Um, and those, I think, will be great with that new silver, too. So this one is called Magical Day. This stamp set, I'll be honest, um, it wasn't like my super favorite, but my husband said that it was super cute and he thought it would be fun. And so, I don't know, I felt the need to like get it for him or something. Not that he stamps a lot, but I did think it was super cute um, with the fact that I have tons of nieces and nephews that are all under, you know, the ages of 10 or, you know, right around there. So I thought this would be great to make sort of that in between, you know, like not the elegant flower ones that I make for my older women and not for, or just 
I didn't mean that as like old, but you know, I kind of, that's sort of my theme because you guys all know I love flowers um, for, you know, my, my girl cards for birthdays. And then my man cards are usually just like kind of generic or not, you know, not kiddish and I need kid cards. And there's actually a framelit set that goes with that. Um, we'll dig that out. Um, the cool thing about the framelit set with that is it cuts out like each of the um, little characters and stuff. There's also designer paper for that. The next thing I have is the Petal Pear Texture Embossing Folders. So there's two and they sort of do like a nice little border piece. So those are super gorgeous. I think like coloring something like that will be super fun too. Next we have a celebration item. This is um, ribbon. Maybe I should take them out of the plastic. So this is a three pack for um, celebration ribbon. And it's sort of like a coral, a gray, and Bermuda Bay. But the other cool thing is, is like this one is super thick. This one's a little bit thinner. And then this one is almost like two um, per um, per thickness of that roll. So I like the variation in, in the sizes on that one. So super cute. And I mean, come on, three rolls in one for free with a $50 order. Like, love it. Sign me up. So then we also have, I have two kits. Um, this one is the Perennial Birthday Project Kit, and this one is super cute. It's like a, um, a recipe box, and it's for cards, and it is just stunning. It's flowers. Oh, almost broke a nail there. Um, it also makes 16 cards, so there's the little, like, tab there, and then it, like, opens up. Super cute. I'll be doing a complete reveal of um, of this kit and unboxing a reveal of this kit. So stay tuned for that. If you do want to see, there's the goodies of it, though. And it makes four cards of each of those four designs. So I will be doing a um, complete unboxing for that one. So stay tuned. Um, we also have, here is an all-inclusive um, kit. So this one is super good. I love all inclusive kits because um, it comes with everything, everything but scissors. And we all have scissors in the house. Whether we can find them or not is another thing, but we all have them. Um, and look at that cute little stripes like lid and everything. So let's open this up. Again, I'll be doing a complete reveal of this one. One of the things that I'm super excited about this one is um, it does include um, colored pencils and these are exclusive colored pencils. These are not in the colored pencil pack um, There is I think Bermuda Bay or no, I'm sorry not Bermuda Bay um, I think that pink might be um, melon mambo and lemon lime and I'm not really sure on all of those, but let's see here is the kit and so there's a little bit of water coloring in that and everything, but super gorgeous. I love doing all-inclusive kits for gifts, too. So um, even though this one doesn't come out until January 3rd, um, there are some kits in the um, annual catalog that you can get as gifts for Christmas this year. Okay, let's do some more stamp sets because there are a ton in here. This one I'm super, super excited about. I love bright colors and rainbows and things like that, so I'm super excited to be able to do each of those in a different color, and then of course there's the sun and clouds. There's also a framelit set. Let's see if I can find it. Um, that also cuts those out, so you can either um, you can do them as like the regular swirls, or you can do them in cardstock. So this is the Rainbow Builder framelits, and it looks like that upside down. And look at these clouds. Isn't that awesome? So excited. So I watched um, a couple of videos that Stampin' Up! posted of a lot of these products. So I was like, okay, need that, need that. So now that I'm seeing it in person, I'm even more excited. Okay, then we have the Petal Palette stamp set. This is a two set or a two box stamp set. So it's got those gorgeous flowers, that little birdie up there. So um, lots of chances for watercoloring or using your blends. The other thing that I love about um, a lot of stamp sets like this are there's great images as well as greetings. And if you can get a greeting and an image together, like you're just, you're golden. Cause then you can just pull that one stamp set out and have everything all in one. This is a celebration stamp set. It is called Beautiful Peacock. 
And you can see you can build that peacock here within the tail and then this tail or swirls and stuff like that. These would also make great borders and everything too. And I'm not worried about the two step or three, four, five step stamping with that because the Stamparatus is coming out and I'm so, so, so excited about that. You can actually pre-order yours now. I will leave a link down below so that you can pre-order yours and get it. Um, of course, it will be first come, first serve when it comes to shipping. So once they get them in, they'll start shipping them. Um, so you won't be getting yours like right away, um, but you can pre-order it. So I'll leave the details for that in, um, in the description box down below. Here is another stamp set. This is a 2B stamp set. This is a celebration one, and this one is actually one that you can earn at the $100 level. So this year they decided to do, um, instead of just the $50, then they have a lot of items for $50, but they have two items that are um, at the $100 level. So they're a little bit more, like two, um, there's 16 total images with lots of great greetings, um, and it's a scrolly font. You know how much I love a scrolly font. Um, so there's that one, and then there is an actual, like, framelit set um, that has just a few words to it. It is called, it's this one, Celebrate You. And this one has Celebrate Amazing and You as the three thinlets there. Um, so that's another item that you can earn as a celebration item for a $100 order. So super, super fabulous there. Oh, here's these masks. These are the Sweet Soiree decorative masks, and I think they'll be super fun for like either um, adding color through it or just adding like a paste. Um, oh, here, we'll use this. So here's one of them. Fabulous little background piece. And then here is the other one, which is technically like cake layers and cake pieces, but won't those be awesome? Wrapped around a greeting or something like that, and... Um, hello, gorgeous, super, super, super love that. Let's see, what else do we have? We have Tutti Fruity Adhesive Backed Sequins. So these are actually adhesive backed, like bright colored sequins. I think there's like, I don't know, it's like bright green, blue, pink, orange, like amazing colors. I'm super excited and you don't have to pull them off the trim. You don't have to use your fine tip glue pen. You can just pop them down and stick. Love it. Thank you Stampin' Up! for making it easy. Ooh, this is the Myths and Magic Specialty Designer or Specialty Washi Tape. Look at that. So like this one here is um, like like silver glittery with silver foil um, stars. Then this one is like blue and white um, glitter, and then this one's like an iridescent glitter. And of course, there's different sizes too. I thought that would be awesome with the the whole myths and magical um, suite. But also, it's just absolutely fabulous. Next up, we have the Brusho Crystal Color. This stuff looks amazing. I can't wait to get my hands on it. There are five colors in here, and you can color and get, like, amazing watercolor techniques. Now, I'm kind of like a perfectionist in where I like the color or the image to come out the same every time, so I do have to sort of set that aside to be able to play with these, so I think it's one of those, like, watercolor things that, like, each one's going to come out different, whether it has more color, less color, more water, less water, that sort of thing, but can't wait to play with those. So, again... Definitely um, be sure to subscribe so that you see more tips and tricks on the press show. Okay, picture perfect birthday. This one, look at all of those candle pieces here and then that cute little bow, but lots of great birthday ideas and greetings. Again, I always send tons of birthday cards, so I need lots and lots of birthday ideas. This is a celebration stamp set. It's called Lots of Lavender. Again, I think this will be fun with um, watercolor pencils, blender pens, blends, markers, um, or lots of other watercoloring um, and coloring tips. This is a celebration stamp set. This is Party Pandas. Aren't these little guys cute? Love them. Um, let's see. We also have this one. It's called In the Trees. And I'm super excited about this one because see this little hammock down here? So you can stamp the tree and then move it over and then stamp the tree and then add the hammock. 
and I saw a really cool way that they used the Stamparatus for that, which is the positioning tool, and all you have to do is bump it over two notches. So the positioning and the spacing, already done for you. How amazing is that? Love it! Okay, what else do we have in here? We have Bird Banter. Again, I thought this one was cute to color in, but I also like the little, like, fun greetings that are at the top too. Again, I love a good stamp set that has greetings and words um, because then it's sort of like an all-in-one stamp set. And I always need, you know, I love my like happy birthday, happy anniversary, but sometimes it's fun to just do one that's like out of, you know, something funny or cute or, you know, you're amazing, something like that. This one is called Amazing Congratulations and I fell in love with it because this, see how this is like half of congratulations and this is the other half and then here's the outline image. So that's super fabulous because you can do like an ombre look. So you can stamp, you know, half of the congratulations in like red and then the other half in yellow or in light and dark blue or like that sort of thing. And again, I'm not too concerned with the Stamparatus coming out um, because then I'll be able to line those up perfectly. But it's also a, um, a photopolymer stamp set, so, you know, lining it up is usually much easier with photopolymer than it is um, with, um, with, like, any, like, the wood block or the clear mount. These I'm super excited about. They're the Glitter and Clear Epoxy Shapes, and I don't even know how I'm going to be able to show these to you because they're clear. Like, they're hard to see. Like, can you see that? Ooh, kind of. Maybe I should take one sheet off. Can, nope. There, how about, nope. There. So you can see them there. And there's like um, raindrop ones, and then there's just different sizes of dots. So super, super cute. I think that'll go really well with the rainbows and, um, and clouds. Because, you know, you can do like raindrops because... I know we have to have the rain in order to um, to get our rainbow. So super, super cute on those, but they are clear, so don't don't lose them, don't misplace them. Then I have Perennial Birthday. This is another flower and greeting stamp set. This one I think has, um, no, that one doesn't have the Mother's Day in it, but I do like those little flowers and the birthday greetings. This one is a celebration stamp set. It's called Amazing You, and I love this image right here. I think it'll be great, like, popping out of the side of your card um, with a little greeting in it, or you can stamp two of them and make it look like a sun. I just, I think it'll be um, gorgeous. And then, of course, coloring that, that flower. And I love the um, amazing and, you, you know, you are simply amazing. Like, I just love that. This one is called Beautiful Day. So in the catalog, it's actually shown using the brush out color. So um, I can't wait to do that with the, um, the two images there. You know I love flowers and I love butterflies too. So, um, so springy and so fabulous. So you can do it with um, the, the new brush out color, but you can also watercolor with it or use your blends or anything like that. So can't wait to color with that. I feel like I'm going to do lots of coloring this coming spring. So um, I'm not a huge colorer, so we'll see how this goes. But maybe I'll either fall in love with it or absolutely hate it after um, a few months. Here is the Magical Mates Framelits. So let me pop those out. That goes with the, um, with like the wizard and, whoa, and, um, and unicorn and all of those images. You can see the dragon, um, unicorn, wizard, uh, mermaid, all of those items um, and everything go for, with that one. And then the other one is called Petals and More. And it goes with one of the stamp sets that, I think it goes with that perennial stamp set. And that's what it looks like. Which I like these little images here at the bottom because I think they're super cute um, to be able to do like borders or little like, you know, details behind your greeting or that sort of thing. Then the last stamp set is Birthday Wishes for You. And that is this one here. And I love that line image because you can color it in or you can just stamp it and have it look fabulous on its own. Okay, 
So next up I have some designer paper. I'm going to go ahead and, um, and pause this and open up all the packs of designer paper so that I'm not wasting time doing that on camera. And then I'll flip through some of them. But stay tuned. I'm going to do a video showcasing each of the designer papers so you can see, um, see what they look like on a bigger piece rather than like a little piece or a little triangle that they have in the catalog. Um, so stay tuned for that. Um, and give me a thumbs up if you're really excited about those um, those videos coming. So hold on just a second, and we will do the um, the designer paper reveal of what's left in the box. Okay, so the first one we have is called Picture Perfect Party, and this one has like confetti and um, lots of great images on one side, and then it's got like large images. Like look at that funfetti cookie. And donuts, numbers, candles, more confetti, party stuff, like super cute stuff. And I love the bright colors. You know how I love bright colors so much. Then this next one is called True Gentleman. And I always struggle with man cards. So I thought that I would get this because it's got like a lot of, um, you know, man prints and, um, and man colors and stuff like that. So great options there. This one is the Tutti Fruity Designer Series paper. It's a six by six, and it's got a lot of great like line patterns on one side, and then it's got fruit on the other side. Ooh, and I almost dropped it. And strawberries. And then this one is called Petal Passion. It's all black and white. So great, you can add color. Ooh. You can add color with um, any of your color tools, or you can always leave it black and white and add a pop of designer series paper color, or I'm sorry, not designer series paper, um, cardstock to, um, to add a pop of color to it. Okay, then the next one is, and this one is called Painted with Love, and I had to get this because I'm so girly girl and just love my pinks and purples, and look at this pink, purple, and that gold. This is a specialty, so there's a lot of gold um, on there. Love it. Look at those little hearts, perfect for Valentine's Day. Love, love, love. And of course, all the back side um, has more, um, has non-blingy um, non pages to it. I'm running out of um, space on my table here. The next pack is the Sweet Soiree, so this goes with the cake and everything, and this is also a specialty pack, so you can see the bling of, um, of the flowers there, and then cakes, and some other patterns. I love the flowers, and again, the back side of that does not have the bling on it, so it's um, just, you know, like a solid um, pattern. And then the last one here is also a specialty. It is Myths and Magic. And this goes with, um, you know, the, the dragons and everything. And look at the glitter. Do you see the glitter on, on all of those mermaids? And that is on each of them. So there's the mermaids, there's stars, there's dragons, there's wizards. Whoa! Whoa! There's unicorns. I don't like that the unicorn is so chubby, though. I want her to look not chubby. Um, and then there's dots. But anyway, that is everything, I think, for my unboxing and reveal of the Occasions Mini Catalog 2018 and celebration promotion. I'm so excited for it to begin on January 3rd. So of course, be sure to um, to subscribe so that you don't miss out any other detailed um, videos that I'm going to do with all of these goodies. Don't forget to check out my blog as well, laurastamppad.com. You can check that out down here. Um, as you'll see uh, more information about this and um, other promotions going on. Of course, my free stamp set of the month this month is Little One, and then I'll have a new one in January. So that's super exciting. So be sure to check that out. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Let me know if there was anything that you can't wait to see me do a video on. And I'll see you all next time. Happy stamping. Bye-bye.